so hello guys welcome to my new video what we are going to see in this video is how to add transitions to video so i recently came across a very uh, library called as xfade uh, so xfade ffmpeg so if you just search xfade ffmpeg it will take you to this link and if you go on this link so this is ffmpeg is basically a tool which is used for playing around with videos, combining videos, splitting videos, etc, etc. And FFmpeg has this uh, new Xfade module which is able to add transitions between two videos. So if you are, uh, if you want to join or combine two videos and add transitions, such kind of beautiful looking transitions to it, so you can definitely use FFmpeg. So the first requirement for this is that you should have FFmpeg installed in your system. So if you have it or not, you if you want to just check it, just open your terminal. So I am using a Mac machine. Uh, you can check on your Windows too. So just check on your terminal. FM FMPEG version. So you see here that I have FMPEG version 5.1.2 and this is the version which is like this or greater than this version is required for XFAID to work nicely. So I think I have the FFmpeg so I don't need to install it again. If you have, if you don't have FFmpeg, so firstly you need to download FFmpeg. You will, uh, I'll, I'll share the link for downloading and how to download FFmpeg. I have shown in uh, other video. I'll share the link for that video in the description below. So once you have FFmpeg downloaded in your system, then you can just open a Visual Studio code. So I have opened a Visual Studio code and I have, uh, opened a new ipynb just to show you and i am in a folder where i have so this is my current working directory and i have some files here so my file name is like video 1 and video 2 which i want to combine first let me show you the video how they are looking so i'll just play this video 1 so this is a video of uh, some candle and it's a 15 second video or uh, full hd video and the other video is this so this is something regarding to snow and all and this is also a 15 second video so my goal is that i want to combine these both videos and i want to add some kind of transition to it which is resembling to this x fade options right so there are a lot of options here so uh, i personally i liked a lot uh, this dissolve option pixelize radial blur so we'll try a bunch of them so what you need to do is that you just need to open your Visual Studio code or you can directly open a terminal also. So I am using the terminal from my Visual Studio code itself. And if you see here that, okay, everything is fine. I will just clear it and just zoom it for you. Okay, so I think you are, you will be able to see it now. Now, you just need to copy this command here. So I will explain you the command paste it here so it says that use ffmpeg the first video is the video one that is our first uh, candle video second is the uh, snow video then you apply a complex filter which is from x fade and the transition name is dissolve and the duration of the transition should be three seconds and since this is a 15 second video so we'll start the transitions from 12 seconds so i'll just put 12 here and uh, this is a dissolve video right so dissolve okay so this is fine now just press enter so you see the video is getting created here so it takes some time but i think it won't take much so the video is created now now what you can do that uh, like i've created this one dissolve right so we can also create some more like the radial blur the only difference here is the name of the complex filter so the transition here is the radial filter and again we are doing it on the 12 second offset so this offset basically is from where you want to start the transition so since it's a 15 second video i want to start the transition from 12 second then therefore i have given the offset of 12. okay let it overwrite so Okay, so the radial one is also ready. Now let's try the pixelized one. Okay. 
so the pixelized one is also getting ready so besides this uh, if i want to see which one looks attractive i think we'll try this uh, circle close circle close let's try circle close so what you will do is that just copy the command again paste it here and where there is a transition name just put circle close so the transition name is here dissolve right here i'll put circle close and just press enter with the new name so we put the name as circle close yeah so it's getting created so i have shown some examples now let's check the result like you can create any of these transitions with the help of the same command so let's check the result so we have bunch of results here so let's see the radial result first okay so if you check the video from this point that is 12th second you will see the transition happening you see the transition happened from the 12th second and it went up till which second did it went to okay 12 it started and it went up till the next point where the second video we so the transition started from the 12th second so this was the radial now let's check the other ones also dissolve so so this is the dissolve one okay you see the transition so smooth right it was so perfect okay this one is also nice now let's check the pixelized one so this was the pixelized transition awesome and now let's check the circum close circle close sorry So perfect right like this is the transition that, like this is how you can add transitions to your videos and combine them using the expert filter you can have like a bunch of applications with the help of this expert and use it uh, in editing your videos like I hope that through this tutorial you have learned something and if you like my work or what I do what I show on YouTube please please do hit the like share and subscribe button till then see you next time